my name is Angelina welcome or welcome back to my channel today we are doing a thrift flip let's just get into it I decided I'm gonna add something to my channel we're gonna try something and we're gonna see if we can find something in the store $20 or less to flip for you guys and then the item will be sold because I'll be making them in different sizes etc etc so whatever I get you can purchase so yeah let's head on into value village off the bat off the bat you guys look at this this could be potentially a super cute flint so that's one item i'm hoping that the next time that i do this i can maybe go somewhere else and maybe find better stuff because it's not really looking in here so let's go check out you guys i literally hate shopping that was the fastest shopping trip ever and i'm kind of happy about that because honestly i found my item pretty quick and i have inspiration i feel like i know what i want her to be and what she's gonna be and i feel like it's on trend so i'm gonna trust my gut and you guys should trust me too in total we spent should i do a total cost at the end i feel like i should do a total cost when I actually finish buying stuff. Because I have to get an elastic, I have to maybe, depending if I have a color, get thread. But so far, we've only spent $7.90, tax included. So, we're on a good path. That was less than $10. My goal was to spend less than 20. Alrighty, let's start the car. I haven't even done a little fit check for y'all. So here's my little sweater that I made for myself. It is Vet Monde Law, you know. And then I have some baggy pants on. I need to like fit check you guys proper. Fit check! <laughs> and that's what we got going on. Okay, you guys, so we are back from the thrift store. This is what we got. And we're gonna transform her into something fun, something new. It's I'm I'm thinking like abominable snowman vibes. Did I even say that correctly? Abominable, abominable. I'm doing a little try on for y'all, but I need y'all to know that this is sickening by itself. This could be its own, you know, moment. It's cute. But yeah, we're gonna make this into something. So stay tuned to watch what it is and I'm gonna show you guys the entire process. Hi everyone, so today we're gonna be working on the flip itself. I'm gonna be getting the pattern done. You guys will see me get that done. And yeah, well, let's, let's transform this bit. <laughs> okay, so right now I am making just a basic pattern, a medium, short pattern set. I'm actually just being lazy. I'm gonna end up making a pattern with the paper over there. I just feel like using this just so my brain can wrap around the shape first. And then, yeah, we're gonna make the shorts. <laughs> There's your visual. That's what it looks like from that perspective that I just gave you. The sides, I discovered, because I didn't look at this properly. But it's fine, it's like not like a con or anything. It's actually like a cute little design feature so i'm gonna work with it i figured this is kind of just a throw on thing it's not really it's not constructed to be like a a top it's literally just two pieces that are tied together with strings so or one whole piece that's folded over with strings so what i'm going to do is i'm going to utilize these strings for the shorts because i think they'll be cute on the side and you can adjust them to however you feel I'm going to pre-tie them though so that they can be adjustable afterwards. Make the shorts, because that's what I'm going to do with this. I'm going to make some cute PJ shorts, but I need to make sure that I have enough fabric to work with because the length, now that I'm looking at it, I'm not sure if I'm going to have enough. So I think the shorts might have to like just be straight up booty shorts, which can't be mad at, you know what I mean? Jump cut, now I'm working on the back piece 
to the front piece. Okay, so I have the four pieces cut out and I'm just gonna attach them together on my sewing machine. So let's do that. Bad news, boys. That's not gonna be able to be a medium, so <laughs> I have to make it a small or an extra small actually. Like, there's definitely no space to make those into some cute shorts that are medium. But I will have bigger sizes available, I promise you guys, especially with this stuff. I'm just a one man band. So I can't help it. But let's get into making them. I kind of want to just snip it, you know what? <laughs> you know what I mean? But I don't want to do that because it's that's a little risque. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do it. I kinda just wanna cut it. Okay, we're not gonna cut it yet. I'm gonna make the pattern. And I'll think about that. Jump scare. <laughs> it's very obviously another day. But um, I ended up having to make adjustments to the shorts. So what I did is I took off this bit. I was able to make the medium like planned, which I'm excited about and I'm happy about. Um, because that was the idea for this outfit. So the shorts, I'm gonna have my mother try them on for me. I've done, I'm gonna hem the t bottom of the top piece see how that looks and then we'll get an idea of how it will look when I do this piece so let's do that my mommy tried it on and it fits her so yeah I'll maybe insert a little picky I took hydrated So, the bad boys are done, and I'm pretty happy with it. It looks very cute, I'm not gonna lie, NGL. I'm very happy with what it looks like. So, final reveal, let's go. Stop scrolling, and look at what I made. Cute, right? 